We went to the antique festival today and what I purchased was this washstand. Now we've had, this is a, a bowl and pitcher that Richard had from his mom. Um, it's been sitting on top of the blanket chest, but that's not really where it belongs. And I've been looking for a washstand. This one is probably a little small because the bowl should actually fit right down into the hole. And this bowl is too big for that. But it still sits there in its proper place. Um, I was hoping it might fit in the corner of the bathroom, but it's, it's, we have this little space right there. But um, it wasn't wide enough, obviously. I thought this wash down was small enough it would fit. I also had it on that wall there. But then I put the issue of where to put the rocking chair. And I said, you know what? There's that little space right there. Need to take the tag off of it. But I'm really happy. It's really cool. It's a pretty good deal. But the absolute deal of the day today is a pride and joy. Something we've looked at a lot um, down in Georgia. But I've never bought one. Really wasn't sure where we put it. And it's a Hoosier cabinet. Except it's not Hoosier. The guy did say Hoosier is a trade name. And I just wiped this down. So I have this fully extended. Um, and I was thinking, boy, if I ever needed it. You know, this could be a serving table. A place where you put some extra dishes. Whatever. Um, so I'm going to see if I can push it in. I might need two hands. Because it's a little stiff. Let's see. I'm going to put it down, let the camera take a ride with me. Ah, there we go. Ouch, that was my finger. Okay, just turn the camera off. So, that's that part of it. It's got a cabinet down here. It probably has the original board right here that you can pull out that you would have worked off of. This I don't think is original to this, although the wood looks old, but it did originally have a, uh, a shelf that went in those grooves. Um, but it's got three drawers over here. One, and this one's a little divider drawer. And this one is uh, like your bread drawer, or as Richard said, the flower drawer. This one has a piece in it. Ugh. Um, ugh, that one's a little tight. Mm. But up here, I think these are beautiful. I've never seen one like this. Of course, I've never seen a wooden one. So this opens like that. And then this has a little latch that catches right there. So I've got all this for storage. And there's this one. Now the other thing that's very different it, <clears throat> on this cabinet is this roll top. Now every Hoosier cabinet I've seen, the roll top goes up. This one actually goes down. And I'm gonna put the camera, I don't think I can do this with one hand. Oh, there we go. This actually goes down. Look at that, and just flattens right out, just like that. That is so, so cool. It's got a little plate right there. Um, had another plate, oh, it's got another plate up there. Right there. That's really cool. Now, whether or not that just stays open for storage, I don't know. But I just put my charger thing in there. And then, this just lifts up. And hooks. Oh, how cool is that? I love it! That is so awesome. Not cool or what? Yeah, it is. Woohoo! <laughs>